Hey guys, Dragonfire CDN on the camera, and welcome back to another episode of Factorio. Today, I'm gonna see if I can sort out moving our uh, red assembling machine production here. Because that's the thing that I need to get sorted out. So let's sort it out. First things first. We're gonna take a blueprint of all of this. Right there. We're gonna take a blueprint of it. I'm gonna click yes, we're gonna save this. So we now have a blueprint of our automated construction there. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to cut off the copper supply to that. And I'm going to cut off the iron supply to that. I'm going to rotate that like that and I'm going to get rid of some of these as well because these are no longer required because they are terrible. So, now what we require to do is remove literally all of this. Right here, all of this needs moving. Get all of this out of here. I just cut off 80% of my base right there. Now nothing's working. Plug that back in. Run a wire to that to plug that all back in. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Unfortunate meantime there. So that's all my science packs going in there at once. <laughs> uh, research is going to stop a second because I'm sorting things out. Right, so this blueprint here needs to be moved. Drastically needs to be moved. Because from where it was there, it was right in the way of all of this. Uh, which we didn't want in the first place. So I'm going to have to move all of this somewhere else. I'll also change the rotation of this. I forgot what the output slot was. There, there's the output slot, right down there. So, we need this to be like that. Right on there. And I can delete that. Remove some trees from the existence of existence. And now, because difficulty here. Because they're ghosts, I can hardly see the damn things. Uh, transport belts. Hooray, hurrah. I hate not being able to see any of this at all.
Right, so this kind of tells me where the rest of them are because I can see the wires going to where they need to be. I like because it's telling me where it is because of the wires. All of this just came to life because of that one. Right. That's just about it for that ghost there. That. Going into there, it's only thick. There's a sound of wind up here, that's a nice touch. Yeah, these are balanced, so they're not, they're able to keep up with it yet. <laughs> There goes another one. What to get next is a good idea. Lab research speed. That's a good thing to get. Assists with uh, quite a bit of stuff. Uh, thinking of what I was doing. Uh, yeah, that. So now all I have to do is plug that into resources. <laughs> and that was connected to a splitter that then came off. So, that's the what resource coming in. Copper. And that's the iron line. Okay, so the iron is over here. Nice and easy access there. Confused as to why I even had a splitter there. So I need a splitter there to. I forgot how to take resources from the inside of this, because then that's got a come out of there, uh, doesn't it? <laughs> so that goes down and then that goes across and out like that. So we also need another set of these underground belts here to go across on there and that's to finish going out there. I've gone confused here um, as to what I was doing with this setup because that belt's got to split off into two and it's got to continue down this road that it was going down a couple of seconds ago. Uh, 
This is gonna end up being the messiest mess of all mess. <laughs> hey, at least it works. <laughs> Yeah, I'll make a couple more of those. Have that going out to there. With some transport belts coming out of that. Alright, there's my iron. Let's get my copper up and connected. So this is my copper. So my copper comes up here. And that's when it has to cross over a gap of four. Because my iron belt comes down there. My underground belt's back. Take them out to there. Take back my normal belts. Need more! Hmm, uh, that's disappointing, actually. <laughs> okay, there we go. Copper floods in. Look at that, though. That's beautiful. How it's sort of slightly uh, separated along its way down. And it all floods in through that side instead. <laughs> That's how it splits up, and then it's... That's already half a drained bus, actually, so I just think I'll switch that a bit. So that this bus will take this portion instead. I don't think my iron can keep up anymore. <laughs> uh, yeah, we need those um, upgraded furnaces, don't we? I've already got them researched, though. Uh, here we are, steel furnace! Hmm. Need stone bricks as well. So down here is we've got the stones. Stone bricks are about to become more important than everything else. Let's make a new blueprint here and just take a blueprint of. Ooh, hold on a second. I want a blueprint of all this. Tell you what, I'll do that over the time that we're here. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching this episode of Factorio. Um, I'm going to sort out stone uh, off camera. Uh, anyways, yeah, so I will sort out that stone bit next and get some steel furnaces. Anyways, see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.